guys welcome to my channel yeah typical you buy a race car or race car and you go ahead and you open up a channel so this is exactly what I'm been doing uh, you guys are gonna see a lot of my build uh, I just picked it up like I said uh, it has a lot of work to get done but you know what I bought it I love it it's, it's gonna be freaking great um, I'm also gonna be recording a lot of the uh, car meets that we do go to uh, for the first car meets that I go to I'm not gonna bring the car just because it does have a lot of uh, little things that I have to take care of but uh, eventually we're gonna go ahead and start bringing the car out and I hope you guys do love the content that I do create and with your support it's just gonna get better all right guys this is my 1990 Toyota Supra I just picked it up uh, yeah it needs paint it's a little project we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna get this all nice and beautiful I typically don't keep my cars long but this one I don't know why but I have an attachment to it already let's go ahead and take you over here so according to what the uh, seller told me, it has a 6262 Garrett Turbo. It looks like it might have a different housing on it. So it does not look like a Garrett housing on it, but a no shaft play and it spools nice. Um, let's see what else we got over here. It is a 1JZ non uh, VVTi with the R154 on it. Get you a nice better look at the car. Came with some really nice NRG prism seats, blue. I mean, it's not gonna go with the color theme I'm gonna do with the car, but hey, it does the job as of now. Looks like it has a nice little three inch full exhaust. We'll go ahead and we'll get you some exhaust clips later on the car. Yep, so when I did pick up the car, guys, um, the guy, he did let me know it needed a tune. So this is the first time I ever bought a car that actually I did not hear run, nor start, nor drive, nor go through any of the gears. I was a little skeptical on it. Um, I am by no means a mechanic. I am like most of you guys, I'm a YouTube mechanic. I go ahead, I buy things, I try it, I learn, and I just get better from there. So actually, I hooked it up to the computer. I downloaded the software because it does have an ECU Master Classic on it. Um, I started playing with it, and eventually I got the car started. So we do have an upcoming uh, tune for it, so I can go ahead and get this car running 100%. And of course, I'll go ahead and record that and keep you guys updated on that. Yeah, I have ADHD. I like to look around if I hear it. But yep, follow my channel so you can keep 